Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Zelda Ocarina of Time. Last episode, we defeated the first boss of the game and also this dungeon. And in this episode, we're actually first going to get a Skulltula I forgot yesterday. So yeah, it was really stupid. I think I was too busy talking about my past and talking about how stupid I was. So yeah, it's right there. <laughs> so stupid, I don't know why I didn't get it, but let's get it now, shall we? Okay, now climb this vine, and then we will get our third Skulltula, I believe. Yeah, you destroy the gold Skulltula. And um, every time you get 10 gold Skulltulas, you get a reward. So um, if you have 10 Skulltulas, you get a reward. If you get 20 Skulltulas, you get a re reward. 30, 40, etc. Till 100. So yeah. That's uh, the only reason why you why you would need those uh, golden sculptures, just to get some rewards. Anyway, let's go outside because we've did we've done this already. As you can see, the Deku tree is still dead, so the Deku tree. Damn! Why do I keep saying? Oh well, it doesn't matter. Who gives a shit anyway? <laughs> so yeah, let's just uh, go back to um, Kokiri Forest, and s these guys are a pushover. I don't even want to fight them. So let's go here. This is where we left off uh, last episode. So let's, dude, go away, Mido. Hi, Curly. What did you do? To create Deku Tree? Did he die? How could you do a thing like that? It's all your fault. What the hell are you talking about, you stupid Mido? Fucking midget. It's all your fault. It's not my fault that the great Deku Tree died. Damn. <laughs> well, anyway, before we move on with the story, I actually want to do some side quests, if you don't mind, of course, because I didn't get any suggestions on what to do, so I think um, you guys don't mind, I guess. So, yeah, I'm actually going to um, to hunt for some Skulltulas and for some heart pieces, because, as you can see, um, yep, there it is. Um, that will show you how many heart pieces you have right now. And there are plenty of those in the game. If you collect four heart pieces, um, you get one full uh, heart. Uh, you get one more, um, one more heart at your health bar. So right now we have four. So if we collect four heart pieces, we get one more heart. Uh, so we get a total of five hearts. So yeah. Anyway, we're in the Lost Woods right now, and I actually want to do some things before we move on. So, wait a second. Did I come from here? Yeah. Yeah, it, <laughs> it is kind of confusing. Confusing, sorry. So, yeah, you just have to know where to go. Luckily, I know, so... Um, if you shoot here, and you do a triple 100 strike, or streak, um, this Deku Scrub will actually come out, and he will actually give you something so yeah let's claim our reward cool you're great you scored three perfect bullseyes I have to give a neat present to such a wonderful person please take it thank you Deku scrub or Deku scrub mm. da -da -da -da. you got a Deku seeds bullet bag this bag can hold up to 40 slingshot bullets yep now we actually now we can actually shoot 10 more bullets, so that's really useful. And before we move on, I actually need 40 rupees. So let's see if I can get that. Um, guess not. Well, that sucks ass. Um, yeah, let's just continue. If I don't get any uh, rupees, I'll just uh, grind for them off screen. But I actually need these rupees for another upgrade before we leave this forest. Because it's the only thing we can do right now. So, we have to go this way, and you can actually see a new enemy there, but who could it be? Hmm, let's see, oh, oh, no, oh my god, well I couldn't um, target him, so that's shitty, well anyway, we need to go here, and there's some, what is this, wait a second, you see a small amount of soft dirt, well, that will be important later on, uh, nothing to worry about at the moment though, 
we now need to get another upgrade for something else. So yeah, as you can see, <coughs> there's another Deku scrub. And we need to, yeah, we need to reflect the blood, uh, the, the nut, I guess. I think he shoots De uh, Deku nuts, I'm not sure though. So, I surrender. To make your quest easier, I can enable you to pick up more Deku sticks, but it will cost you 40 rupees. And of course, I don't have 40 rupees, so I'll see you guys later when I get 40 rupees. <laughs> okay, welcome back everyone, I finally got 40 rupees, so let's buy it. Thank you very much! Da -da -da -da. Now you can carry up to 20 Deku sticks. So yeah, that's um, all we can do in this forest at the moment, there's not much else we can do. Um, well, there could be something, but I'm going to do that later. So let's just get the hell out of here. Let's just go to um, Hyrule Castle or something. But no, we're actually going to Hyrule Field first. You always have to go to Hyrule Field first. But after we do that, we're actually going to do some um, some other side quests and even a mini game before we go to Hyrule Castle because I actually want to collect some other things first. So yeah, let's get out of here. Okay, so now we're back in Kokiri Forest and now we need to go to Hyrule Field. So that's that way. If you don't um, defeat the first boss of the game and don't complete the dungeon, you won't be able to go inside uh, there because that guy will guard the entrance. But now we can go, so that's cool. Okay, let's get out of here. What? Oh, you're leaving. Saria? What are you doing here? I knew. That you would leave the forest someday, Curly. Because you are different from me and my friends. But that's okay, because we'll be friends forever, won't we? I want you to have this ocarina. Please take good care of it. Boom! And now we get um, one of the most important items in the game. The ocarina. All Karina, Ocarina, whatever! I don't give a shit! <laughs> so yeah, you received the fairy Ocarina. This is a memento from Seria. Set it to C and press C to start playing it. On the select blah blah blah, I know. I know what to do. So you can, um, um, with this instrument, you can, yeah, you can play different notes with A and the four C buttons. Press B to quit playing or to start your song over again. So, over the course of this game, we will actually gain new songs, so yeah. When you play my ocarina, I hope you will think of me and come back to the forest to visit. Okay, Seria, no worry. I'll be going back for you. One day. But not now, I have to go. <laughs> Don't worry, Seria, I'll be alright. Yeah. So, are we finally going to Hyrule Field? Yes! Hyrule Field. You know, my when I first saw Hyrule Field and I was walking around in it, my mind was blown. Simply because I got stuck in this game in the first dungeon for nearly two years. One or two years, I'm not quite sure. But I was so happy that I finally could do something else than just staying in that stupid forest. I want to wanted to explore. I wanted to explore Hyrule Field. I wanted to know how the different um, regions looked like. So yeah. And oh no! This my guys is my most disliked character in the game. It appears that the time has finally come for you to start your adventure. Hoot hoot. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged even during the toughest times. Go blah 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 blah. And whenever you skip all the text, be sure to not hit A again, because then this guy will screw you over like this. Did you get all that? No! And of course the yes option is down, so when you're skipping, you keep pressing no, you keep pressing no, so you keep reading the stupid text. Oh my god, I hate this fucking owl. Yes, I got it. Alright then, I'll see you around. <laughs> I hate this fucking owl. He gives you pointless information like on how to look at a map. Dude, everyone knows how to look at a map. Just go away. 
Stop being such a asshole. Anyway, we're actually kind of running low on time, I see. So I really need to hurry up. So, oh my god, oh my god, what is this? P hat. Oh, wh wh wait, what? P hat? Its weak point is its roots. Okay, no, I don't give a shit. I wanna, I wanna run, man. I wanna run. Go. So actually, Hyrule Field is actually pretty big for such an old game. Back in the days, Hyrule Field was mind-boggling, mind-bogglingly big. But nowadays, it's kind of, kind of small, I guess. It is true. It is kind of small uh, compared to today's standards. But oh my god, I love this. I love Hyrule Field. It's so cool. So, so, I don't know. I don't know what's so cool about it. Maybe it's just nostalgia or something. And oh my god, the sun is going under. So, what will happen next? Oh my god, yeah, there actually spawn enemies in the night. During the day, it's pretty safe. Well, except for the pea hats, but in the night, these guys will attack you. Stall child, don't be afraid of the stall child, just attack it repeatedly. Yep, like this. Oh, you die! Ooh. And there's actually a kind of. I don't know if it's an Easter egg or something, but if you kill enough stall childs like these, um, a bigger stall child will, will appear. Actually, surprisingly bigger. And every time you keep killing those stall childs, and every time that giant will come back, it will grow bigger. So, yeah, that's really, really unique. There's all, th I think there's a couple of more monsters that have that in this game. Not quite sure though. And it's really dark outside, so I need to watch out where I'm going. But I know where to go, I guess, so... Oh my god! Curly, wait up, buddy! Woohoo! Head so from here! To reach... Oh my god, I forgot his voice again. Ah! To reach Lake Hylia for rich waters! If... Oh my god, I just don't want you to talk anymore. Do you want to hear what I said again? No! No matter how hard it is, just don't get discouraged. Woohoo! Oh my god, that is why that owl is so annoying. Whenever you just want to to immerse yourself into this game and just want to play the game, that stupid owl will appear and he will tell you pointless information that you already know or you're about to find out. So, oh, damn, he's so annoying. I think he's even more annoying than Navi. Navi isn't that bad, actually. Well, yeah, she has something, sometimes she has something to say, but you can just ignore her. This stupid owl, you cannot ignore. Well, you could ignore him by not going to this area or something. But yeah, you have to. Uh, well, well, maybe you don't have to, but yeah, you don't. You know what I mean. Gerudo Valley. Okay. This this area is actually some kick-ass music, I must say. But um, sadly, the music only plays during the day. And talk about it, devil. It's almost day. Or speak about a devil damn it anyway let's go that way and in the nights there will actually uh, uh, appear a golden sculpture up there but we can't reach it we will get that later however so yeah do -do 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 -do. oh my god music is so awesome so the first thing I want to do there's actually two heart uh, pieces to uh, obtain around here so let's first grab this cuckoo this cuckoo or chicken or whatever and let's jump from this side. Yeah. Oh my god. This is some big height. Okay, let's jump down. Wait a second. Wait a second. The heart piece is actually hidden behind the waterfall. So we actually want to go that way. Oh damn. No, Link. Damn, I didn't want to do that. Okay, please go to shore. Please, Link. Thank you. Okay. Okay, now we can finally get that heart piece. Oh, and what's that? Let's see. This thing will actually um, be important later on, or not very important. Uh, it's kind of useful, but um, you'll, I'll talk about those later. Not, not right now. So let's just go up. Those will be uh, important later. <laughs> not at the moment. So, okay. So we have to climb this ladder, and at the end of the ladder is a heart piece. So yeah, this... It's actually one of the first heart pieces I always get when I play this game. So yeah, you really have to go out of your way to get this piece of heart. That's why I'm doing it right now. Because else I'll have to do it... I I'll have to do it sometime, so I might as well do it now, right? <laughs> so 
So yeah, if you go downstream, you'll actually go to Lake Hylia, where that stupid owl was talking about. And we're a I actually have some things to do there, so yeah, we might as well go to there. And there's also another hard piece in this area, but we will uh, get that one later, I guess. Yeah, let's just first go into this area. And it's getting dark already? Damn, that's quick. So yeah, Lake Hylia, oh my god. It is not even dark, I'm... I'm just making jokes, I guess. So yeah, Lake Hylia, cool. So what I actually wanted to do is I wanted to play a mini game. And it's actually a kinda annoying, frustrating minigame, I guess. Um, but I don't know if I have enough time to do that, so yeah, I'm kinda wondering. Hmm. Uh, I don't wanna waste uh, too much time on that, so before we do that, let's actually collect another gold sculptula. And how surprisingly, it's getting dark, and this sculptula you can only get when it's dark. So uh, let's get that one while we're at it. There are, there are, all, um, there are also a couple of more sculptures to obtain here. But oh my god, it's stupid! Oh, go away, you stalker! But we can't get those at the moment. There's only one I can get now. So I'll get that. Um, <laughs> I'll get it right now, yeah. So okay, hurry up. Okay, and actually, what is this stone? This thingy? This will also be important later on, so just, um, well, you can you can remember that stone for later, I guess. Oh, wait a second, what's this? When water fills the lake, shoot for the morning light. That's also something that we will see later on, so <laughs> don't worry about that. I'm kind of early in this area of the game, so, yeah. Also, we need to get this way. And there should actually be a golden sculpture. There it is! Look at that, look at that beauty. Yeah, You destroyed the gold sculpture, thank you. Okay, so let's now swim. Yeah, you can actually swim. Oh, wait, you know already. We've done it in the first dungeon. I'm so... Why do I keep forgetting that? Anyway, um, if you... Yeah, if you um, keep pressing on B, you'll actually swim a little bit faster. I hope it won't get boring too soon. As you can see, there's land up there. And that's the mini game we're going to do. Well, I can spoil it right now. It's a fishing mini game. Yes, a fishing mini game in a action adventure game. That's amazing. If you ask me, it's so cool. Anyway, um let's see. What does it say? Check. Fishing pond. The fish are really biting today. So yeah. In the next episode, I'm going to enter this um fishing pond and we're going to um to catch some fish, yeah. We're going to catch some fish. And I really hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, be sure to leave feedback on um, on if it's a good idea that I do side quests uh, before doing the the main story. If you don't like it, just leave it in the comments. Just leave your thoughts in the in the comments. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you all for watching. Goodbye.